Hey guys, Judo fans, this is Kyle Reddish, and I'm here with Eric Ariola, who just got second place at KMC Nebraska with mm. this uh, very interesting 52 card. Yeah. 52 card light water darkness nature build. So, uh, two havens. Yes, sir. Why not three? Um, I was looking at the post off of Facebook for Nebraska, and it seemed like it was more rush oriented. So, I was thinking three and drama off a bottle would have been better than Haven because I'm down to zero shields. Haven would only give me maybe one extra blocker, or a drama would give me two extra shields and cut that attack in half. Okay. So, so you're saying the shield regeneration is, yeah. is why you went with three and drama. Yeah. And it would be more plainly see later on throughout the deck list you would see. So. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, two Lyra, the Blazing Sun? Yeah. Why two, not three? Um, you'll see. There's a couple more cards. Sure, sure, yeah, sure. Yeah. Two Storm Sparks. Yeah. Why two? Not I three? am not a fan of Storm Spark. I like Storm Spark, but it doesn't really help me unless I'm playing a mirror match where mm -hmm. I can run over my opponent's creatures mm -hmm. depending on what they have in play. Okay. I, I've been noticing that a lot, a lot, of, a lot of teams and stuff are cutting to two or cutting it all all together. Mm -hmm. This guy, this guy was pretty good for you today. Uh, yeah, these this three. is, this is these the three reason actually. why right here. These three. Uh, ah, the reason space. why I have two is to make room for him. Otherwise, okay. I would have had three Lyra. But again, because of the meta that I was seeing, it seemed rush. Um, I was having these two in there for anti birds and dragons, and then also for going over Lyra and then just getting that extra shield if I'm down um, shields from aggressive decks. Plus it. it it, it can attack us when it comes into mm -hmm. the battle zone. Yeah. Uh, Aqua Strider, this pretty much the best good, blocker in the yeah, game. Yeah, pretty good blocker. Enforcer, Evo, Evo. Yeah. Um, uh, Evo. Evo. Yeah, isn't that cool? Yeah. That's a cool tech. I like that. For evolving. Mm -hmm. Evolving. And, and not this guy. Yeah. Um, two PJs? Um, mainly because wow. I... Yeah. Your opponents would think you're running three. Because I have some discard lineup you were seeing a bit. That's why I'm running couple of two calls, uh, two copies of most spells. Okay. Yeah. Uh, I don't see Keeper of Laws in here. Um, yeah. Uh, you probably see why when we get down to the end. Totally I explain cool. why. Totally cool. It is 52 cards. So, it is 52, uh, sir. Yes. Uh, two Crystal Memory. Two Crystal. Shield Blast. Let you go get what you want. Search. The, the main focus of the draw is, of course, Crystal and uh, Reaping Soul because of no Keepers, but y'all see why a little bit later on. Totally cool. Uh, Seems like a staple against um, rush aggressive decks. Bottle. You can always do silly stuff like yeah. uh, Haven, Squatter, yeah, and Haven. Uh, two grips of despair. Two grips. Okay. Keep keeping it to the two ups just to keep the deck. Um, because of under the discard 60. you were seeing in the next sure. two cards, yeah. Uh, uh, two scrollers. Um, very, very, very good card. Um, helps games. Uh, so far, only one time this entire tournament, I did scrollers. Drew an irrelevant card and another score list and got game because of that. So, uh, might be bumping up to three, but two is really good. And then yeah, that. three mesmerize. Uh, yes, three mesmerize for the hand control. Early game, late game. Yes, understood. Very useful. Two bone blades. I have a lot of people are switching the two instead of three. Yeah, because uh, as you see, uh, I have nine blockers. So basically, the blocker will help against rush, and the bone blades against mirror matches does not really help. And if you do play against aggressive decks, uh, like I said, the blockers and the other shield blasts will be more helpful than bone blades. Mm -hmm. But just there, just for the early removal if I need it. Absolutely. Uh, two banding whispers? Yeah, for more discards, you saw Mesmerize, Whispers, and um, Puppet seems to be a, almost like the trifecta of discard right now. Okay. The Spire Puppet? Uh, yeah, Spire Puppet. Spire yeah. Puppet. Absolutely. Did you ever totally just surprise your opponent? Uh, yeah, usually I build up mana because of the ramp. I do crystal, and if they have keeper of laws, I always make sure you want to draw, they draw, and use either whispers or spar puppet or get it mesmerized and discard the extra card in the hand as well. Totally cool. Uh, maxing out the triple yeah. uh, tear Key card. Get sort of other people's Andromedas, stuff like that. Yeah. Big creatures, minus Haven, yada, yada, yada. Uh, uh, not minus Haven, but. Yeah, to get rid of the bigger cards that can be targeted. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Um, Reap and Sow? Um, yeah, just basic mana generation. Just help me get up to the high costing creatures that much faster. Yeah, I saw you sometimes, uh, you wouldn't play a mana, you would just go right into Reap and Sow. Yeah, because it's basically you, playing the mana anyway, so I don't burn out my hand since, exactly. as you see, I don't have many draw cards because of no keeper. 
So I just try to conserve my hand as much as possible, especially if I'm playing a mirror match with discard. Absolutely. Uh, Tendril Grasp? Uh, just for the rush meta, did not help at all today. I would definitely take that out. But because I thought I was playing rush, I had the cards to fight against rush. Maybe two other keepers, maybe two round knocks. This could have nature. probably been keepers. Uh, nature I was doing pretty good with, but either Ramnoth or Keeper Walls would probably be taking his place if I would know what would happen today. Uh, two root trap? Just uh, keep yeah, just extra shield blasts and just more nature cards so I can get off my mana and block it off as early as possible. And this guy? This guy? This guy seems um, really cool. Steamwing, yeah. For, I did play against one Mono Light and this kind of helped me because they play Rota Gale. He didn't want to lose his Rota Gale so he took him a while before he started attacking in. And then as soon as he did attack in, I let the attack go through. Next turn, Cobalt, attack over it, gain mm. an extra shield. So basically, he drew a card for that attack. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Yeah. Uh, of course, another Enforcer Blocker. Enforcer Lemon. Blocker, Rant. Very useful. Yeah, great card. Um, it's able to attack because it's got Skirmisher. Mm -hmm. And Spire Puppet went with to, the three. To finish up the trifecta of discarding, um, like I said, uh, by Crystal or cast a dispel basically so they can draw off a keeper usually have four extra mana I played that to discard the card they just drew so it kind of helped me thin out their deck um, I only played one deck that was close to 60 or at 60 and uh, everything else was close to my card count so it was helping me to deck them out that much faster so if it did went to a long game which I think two of my matches were that uh, I would help be able to deck them out, combine them with Squillas, and just keep on having defense Absolutely. against my opponent. Well, there you guys have it. That's going to be the 52 card? 52 cards, 52 card. even control, the basic, basic builds, yeah. Last simple question. I know you live 30 minutes from Irving, but you will be at the championship? I will be there and hopefully get my rematch against the person I lost to today. <laughs> Go get Michael? Go against Michael, yeah. I'm telling you. All right, man. Congratulations. We'll see you in Irving. All right. Leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe. Peach. Yeah.